With today's technology and massive machinery, it's easy to lose sight of how major infrastructure was built at the turn of the 20th century. The accomplishments of Canada's early engineers and works are truly unbelievable. It's amazing to think that infrastructure built over a century ago is still being used today. Case in point, the Peterborough Liftlock. Built in 1904, this liftlock was the gem of the Trent Severn Waterway. At one time, it was the world's largest unreinforced concrete structure, and today it is still the world's highest hydraulic liftlock, raising boats a whopping 20 meters. This lock holds a special place in many people's hearts. Everybody's got at least one story at the lift lock. It is also a flagship asset for the Trent Severn Waterway. It's a special place to be sure. Just how special this lock is really shines through when looking at the century-old precision engineering that still functions to this day. Each of these giant boat chambers sit on a 2.3 meters in diameter ram that is sunken into the ground and connected to a water pipe and control valve. By controlling the flow of water between the rams and using the gravity of the higher boat chamber, boats are efficiently raised and lowered from one elevation to the other. Now, after decades of use, these rams are starting to show their age. These sections are original and they've just reached the end of their service life and we felt that we needed to replace these components to ensure continued operation of the site. Not an easy task, but Western Mechanical has the equipment, crew and game plan to get it done. This is a perfect job for Western Mechanical. We specialize in complex jobs and this is a complex job. Before they can begin any removal, Western will need to shore things up. A self-designed support structure to hold up each ram during the replacement is installed. We're going to be using cans of various sizes to support the uh, tub. And then the lower section has a jack in it. And we're going to use that to lift it the final 24 inches out of the bore. We need to do that so we can get the access to the lower section to get it clear of the uh, lower press. These locks operating individually are painfully slow, so the crew from Western will be putting in long hours to ensure that both sides are fully operational by the time boating season rolls around. Come back underneath the edge. Yeah. As the ram is hoisted up, Western uses their custom-made removal cart to wheel the bottom section away. It's loaded onto a truck by crane and shipped to Barry Weldon. Here, the new component is created from the old piece's exact dimensions. They also have the original drawings to fall back on. And we're amazed at the quality of the old manufactured components. They are exactly to the drawings. Uh, it's very, very interesting that 118 years, 120 years ago, that they could manufacture to such fine detail. They did a wonderful job. Once all the specifications are met, Barry Welding begins machining the new components. It has 40 inch and a quarter holes at the top, and we're able to confirm the location of all of those holes. This precision will allow for a perfect fit. Back at Peterborough Lift Lock number 21. Once the newly fabricated ram section arrives back on the site, it's lowered down and into position with the utmost care. This piece alone weighs close to 20,000 pounds. Once we uh, lowered the piece down, we cleaned it all off, blew the holes out with compressed air. It is pulled under the ram. The bolt holes have to be exactly lined up. There are 40 of them, and they can't be off by more than a hair. Western Mechanical checks the alignment of the lower ram section bays to make sure it is still plumb. 
Gary's up and being lowered down the hall. Once everyone is happy, the bolts are torqued down. With the summer rapidly approaching, there's no time to waste. The team removes their shoring system from the eastern section and quickly install it in the western bay. The western ram section is removed and hauled off to be duplicated. A quick trip to Barrie and the new ram section is manufactured. Then it's shipped back to site where it's installed. Okay, coming up on the cable. Just like in the Eastern Bay, the Western Ram section is cleared of any debris. Carefully rolled into place. And finally torqued down. These final steps bring this monumental job to a close. With its new bottom ram pieces installed, the Peterborough Liftlock has a new lease on life. Everything went very well. Yeah, we had a great crew. Things went really smoothly, well planned. That's yeah, a good feeling. Yeah, it's a sense of reward when it's all done. Everything works well and it's on time. Thanks to Western Mechanical's sharp minds, innovative ideas, and skilled workers, this historic liftlock can continue to keep boats moving along the Trent Severn waterway for years to come. Western Mechanical appreciates the preliminary work performed by the Parks Canada team. The teamwork between Parks Canada, Grouper Welding, Barry Welding and Western Mechanical made this project a great success.